a rehearsal for a beautiful composition called Alzheimer's Stories um, that was written by Robert Cohen and we're bringing this composition here as a special concert event to raise awareness and funding for Alzheimer's disease and other dementias. It's going to be performed in three different venues by the Mississippi Chorus in Jackson on October the 27th, in Cleveland on October the 28th, and in Tupelo on October the 29th. heard this piece before and been very interested in doing it. I'd never worked with a group before who really latched onto the idea the way the Mississippi Chorus has. They just embraced it enthusiastically because they want to reach out into the community and, and be a part of, of Jackson and all of Mississippi. meaningful piece of music I have ever sung. The first part is all about the numbers and if anybody doesn't understand about Alzheimer's disease it's one in 85 people worldwide. is for the families and if you've ever had anybody in your family that has faced the challenges of Alzheimer's disease you will melt when you hear these words they are they're perfect they're absolutely perfect we laugh a little bit we cry a little bit it's just a very poignant piece of music and then the final portion is all about the caregivers and if anybody has had the challenges of caring for someone with Alzheimer's disease it will speak to them it'll speak to their heart directly and it spoke to mine. I had parents that lived in my home for the last five years of their life and they would have their heads down but I would play hymns until my hands fell off almost at night. They would know every verse to every single hymn I could play. Music changes everything. My mom, she didn't die from dementia, but she was suffering from severe dementia at the time of her passing. It's personal for almost everybody in the room. One of the concerns that we have as a group is how do we avoid the emotions of the piece overtaking us in the middle of performance and making it more difficult to present. The music, if you, as, you, as a listener, takes you through the journey of people that are dealing with the disease. You can just see it in the music and the way it's written and the, the effects of the sounds and everything. It's just beautiful. And uh, you would think that a song about Alzheimer's would be depressing, but it's very uplifting and very hopeful. The Mind Center is partnering with the Mississippi Chorus to bring this concert event to Mississippi, along with several other organizations here in the area that are part of what we call the Dementia Network, and that includes Alzheimer's Mississippi, the State Division of Alzheimer's, and the Alzheimer's Association. and made up of about a hundred singers. We do primarily choral masterworks, and those would be classical pieces from Bach to Beethoven. We also do eclectic and contemporary pieces like the one that we're doing for Alzheimer's Stories. Make sure that one is empty five people worldwide. Come and hear it, participate in it fully. You won't just be hearing music, you'll be meeting the composer. You'll be having a chance to learn more about the interaction of music with the mind. And then you'll have an opportunity to begin to give back through your time and uh, monetarily and being involved in the whole process of Alzheimer's research.